home tonight. Let Evo Bang, thanks for the prime, baby. Thirty months. Ah, I get the nectar of the gods. Boomer drink. Who's the trash? Sidigi or the ale? Oh, yeah. Oh, it comes right now. Did I even taste it? Yeah, of course I taste it. It's like one shot. All right, it's like one shot. Um, good morning, everybody. How is everyone doing today? In case you're wondering, I'm doing just fine. How are you guys? Welcome, welcome. Who do we have in the chat? We got Mr. Moondog, we got Smack, we got Pooba. We got Mr. Tizzle. Oh, nice. There we go. Ooh. Thank you for the 200 bits. Uh, we got Mr. Gom. What are we doing today? Uh, good question. Uh, we got Brown Town in the house. We got Rob Jovi. We got Collecto Ray Rizzo. We got Hostiles, Harold, Totobaru, Air Force. We got VG2D. We got Lunatic. We got Doggy. We got Devil Man. We got Axel. We got Renegator. We got Mibu, we got Quanzo, we got Mr. Zodiac, we got Chris G, we got Bilgin Waffles, we got Slug Chris. Wait, what's your shit? Where am I going? We got Alu, we got Carl, we got Jalen Fan, we got Jeff Tex, we got Davis Game, we got Unlucky, we got Killer Pickle, we got Salaxi, we got Advent, we got Trazer, we got Jive, we got Unlucky, Cache. Nasper, we got Odo, Oda, Oda Do Daddy, we got NATO Filter, Etorpu, we got Sketch, we got Mr. Sausage King, wait, we got two bots announcing our streams, I do, we got Seishin, we got uh, Cake Mage, we got Air 4, Free to one what the heck kind of name is that, we got King Salami, thanks for the 32 months, baby, we got, jo oh shit, ah, fuck, ah, ah, my ankle, my ankle, Ah, uh, guys, my ankle's not healing any better, okay? If anything, it feels worse today than it has in the past several days, man. Sheba. Whoo! Pink cord and me six? Um, we must be doing something new. I have no idea. That's, uh, that's Silphus's business. I have no clue. Silphus is the Discord admin, so... I don't know. I don't know what the heck's going on there. We got, we got Mr. Sushi. We got triple sevens, baby. We got Robbie. We got Mr. Jake Doe. Ah, uh, Mr. Moondog's here. We got... No, my ankle boot is not on. I left that at my friend's house. I feel like uh, ankle boot is such a pain in the ass. Woof. Robbie Rock with the tier two. Hell yeah, baby boy. That's what I'm talking about. Hell yeah, baby. We got Mr. Edge. Am I limping? No, I'm just, uh, I'm just being very careful with how I walk. I just can't do anything very physically demanding for the next God knows how long, okay? I know, it's pretty rough for an IRL streamer. Uh, we got Lubu Smash. We got Ood, D D L R L whatever. Number 32, good morning. Yeah, the ankle boot hella slows us down, and if anything, I limp more because of the difference in size, okay? Uh, 60, I'm wearing it wrong for it being a pain in the ass. Okay, I see what you're trying to say. <laughs> oh my gosh, Shaq! Shaq, my boy, thanks for the five gifted subs, baby! Um, Mr. Junior is asking, did it snow when the question answers itself? You're seeing it snow right now. 
Okay, the boot will help me heal faster. Fuck the boot. Fuck the boot. Okay, fuck the boot. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, good morning. If you guys are new to the stream, the first 45 minutes to an hour, sometimes 10 hours, is the intro phase to the stream. And we got a rather short day today. I know, I know. The streams have kind of been suffering a lot, but... I think uh, at the end of the day, my mission is far more important to me, but I gotta find a healthy balance. You know what I mean? I gotta find a healthy balance. Uh, but let, let's, let's talk about things. Let's talk about things. First of all, for those of you guys that just tuned in, obviously uh, we have one, number one, streamer awards nominations is still open for the remainder of this week. So, uh, why not make things interesting and spicy by, by voting for Cook Sucks in whatever category you think would be best? I mean, I would say IRL Streamer of the Year is going to be a tough win, to be honest. But we had a strong year, okay? You voted Jay Streezy already? Jay Streezy deserves it, of course. But for everybody else that hasn't had a chance, the link is pinned at the top. Please take a few moments out of your day to uh, do me a solid because hey man the more recognition I get the more chance I have to make some quality content and when I say quality content I got some stuff brewing okay 2024 is gonna be a heck of strong one uh, and before people say well 2024 you haven't even really streamed that much yes but you have to understand I was banned and then I had an ankle injury and then I also have this covert mission okay to help streamers and I, i've just been very busy but don't worry my mission is almost i'll be done by mid mid february okay <laughs> i'll be i'll be done by mid mid february okay and uh if people are like what the hell kind of mission is cook sucks talking about i will harrison did five subs what the heck arenos harrison thanks for the five get the subs you didn't have to do that brother i'll take it though thank you Dude, Harrison, isn't it crazy how Steven is sweeping the awards? Sweeping. Golden Globes, the Emmys. Can they get the Oscars or is that only for uh, movies, right? That's only for movies. Shit. That's crazy. What was I banned for and for how long? Uh... Yo, if you don't know the details of why I was banned, then it's not that important, okay? Uh, the, the point is, I'm not banned anymore. It was only for, it only lasted 24 hours. <clears throat> Anyways, let's talk about this week, okay? So, for those of you guys that haven't, dude, this rain is half melt, or the snow is half melted, it's like rain. Uh, for those of you guys that are new to the stream or haven't been watching, let me do a quick introduction, okay? I'm Andy, aka Cook Sucks. I'm a, I, are, I mean, I'm a streamer that predominantly does IRL content, travel content, and I started streaming four and a half years ago, okay, I'm from Los Angeles, California, and, uh, you know, after many years, I am now finding myself here in Korea, back again for the third season of, uh, you know, Korea content, and while I'm here, I was originally coming here to just have... Uh, you know, final fun mission or f final fun adventures with my streamer friends here in Korea because I don't know if you've been living under a rock, but you know, month ago, Twitch announced that they are gonna be shutting down Twitch Korea. But you know, ever since then, there have been many uh, options and opportunities for some of these streamers to, uh, let's just say, transition back into Twitch should they choose to. Here's the thing, not all streamers are gonna be staying anyways I, I i don't want to mention any names but regardless of what the solution is some people are actually going to be done with twitch and they find this to be their easy excuse and way out of the system but uh you know you think that those streamers would be down to have like a final stream adventure but i think they're just gonna like actually wash their hands from it and just be done. So 
uh, no collabs with some of those streamers, okay? But the ones that do want to stay on Twitch, obviously they're down to meet up, have a conversation, and, uh, you know, we've been uh, doing some collaborations. Yes, Sation, English streamers. Uh, one of those streamers was going to be Miss Beck Elong, formerly known as Bubbly, but I think Bubbly still has uh, realized that streaming on Twitch is... It's still a good thing, okay? So I have probably helped convince her to stay on the platform, even though she's a grown adult and she can make whatever choice she wants. That's just an example. But uh, she's probably gonna be staying on Twitch for the long haul and also pursuing her music career on YouTube, right? Um, anyways, so if you guys have been watching the streams, uh, I came to Korea probably about one month ago i mean a little less than one month ago it's it's already been almost three weeks and uh you know we've had quite a few adventures so far but i feel like uh, because of the cold temperature and maybe even like <clears throat> the mood it hasn't been very easy to secure meeting ups or meetups with some of these streamers because you know everyone's just very busy with doing their own life stuff being depressed or, you know, really contemplating what they're going to be doing on Twitch. And uh, they don't realize that uh, I, Andy, a.k.a. Cook Sucks, I'm not just a joke, okay? I'm not just one of those dudes that is uh, coming up with fantasies and theories and whatever. I actually have a gift. And, um, hold on. I have a gift. And that gift is not my gift, it's a gift given to me to give to other streamers, but uh, I, think, I think only now uh, people's schedules are starting to open up and uh, I, I have been reaching out to more people outside of my normal friend group and again, the collaborations and meetings have been uh, stacking and it's getting more and more busy and originally I was thinking, yeah I know, Steven's getting a ton of fucking awards. Anyways, uh, with the scheduling, I was originally planning on having these meetings on the top, the, the end of December, top half of January, so that by the end of January, when it gets really cold, I can start traveling again, go to like Hong Kong uh, or Vietnam for a little bit, and then come back to Korea to finish off. But because everyone has been so fucking lazy, all of the meetings are starting this week onwards okay and when i say this week onwards you guys have seen like the first first stream i did uh after coming back from all the trips we hung out with miss bv nuna right we had a that was an awesome stream i think i don't know how many of you guys watched that collaboration but that was fun we had a nice meeting afterwards then the next day finally miss yummy uh got to meet up with me we had our fun stream and uh, she's right now on a ski trip with the, all, the, all the girls, but you know, it was good to see Miss Yummy again. And then yesterday, I met up with Rhea, AKA Satan Mate, my dear Russian Korean streamer friend. And uh, I made a big boo boo, okay? I was under the original impression that we were gonna be. Hey, what up, Nicholas? Oh, Nicholas, we got a lot to talk about, brother. Uh, I was under the impression in the beginning that we were going to be doing a stream collab together, but I think I made the communication wrong and she just thought that we were just going to be meeting off stream for like dinner and I was like, ah shit, okay. So yesterday, uh, obviously canceled the stream plans, Rhea and I met up, we had a little conversation meeting and then, you know, I, I went back home but because it was just too late to stream anyways. So. Don't worry, Satan Mate and I will be doing a collaboration sometime soon, but Satan's not gonna be going anywhere, I don't think. If anything, I probably helped her realize that she could do much bigger things, more things, and uh, who knows, who knows, who knows. Anyways, so uh, let's, let's have a little bit of updates from what's been going on since yesterday. Um, yeah, Miss Froggy, for those of you guys that, uh, know who Miss Yoon Kegudi is, aka Froggy, my dear friend, 
my little hobbit friend, uh, aka now Big Booba Streamer, she finally reached out again and uh, she was saying how she was super busy on Africa for a little bit and uh, she also got pneumonia. Okay, so she is getting a little bit better now. Okay, sorry, the lens. Look, I can't help it. It's fucking raining snow. Um, she's recovering from pneumonia right now and uh, I will be meeting her on Tuesday and on Tuesday maybe like a short little stream oh my god dudes Tuesday next Tuesday we're probably gonna be doing like a short little stream I'm gonna have a conversation with her and uh, we are gonna be planning for possibly camping trip part two I don't know if anybody remembers our camping trip that we did back in 2022 but uh, I think we're gonna try to get the old gang together maybe even have Charming Joe come and join us as well if he's down because he was originally supposed to join us that last time and uh, you know five people going on a little three-day trip not a bad idea okay will you be going I'm actually gonna be meeting you tonight Mr. Carlo, thanks for the new sub, baby. Welcome to the Happy Boys, motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe glamping trip. I have no idea. Here's the thing. Um, in my mind, I'm like, ah, oh, man, Froggy's way too big now to be, to be going uh, camping with small streamer like me. Andy, a.k.a. Cook Sucks. But uh, Froggy's not like that, okay? Froggy's still down, and uh, because she still wants to stay on Twitch... Regardless of what happens, uh, I think she's down to still, you know, she's cool. Do I have to bring an interpreter for any of my meetings? Well, here's the thing. So, uh, when I was talking to Miss Froggy on the phone last night, she was telling me how there's uh, certain other streamers that I was, let's say, not 100% confident in reaching out to because I was like, why, why the heck would they want to meet up with me? Like, even though we're... Instagram slash Twitch friends, but uh, she was like, oh yeah, so-and-so, they, they really want to meet you, blah, 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 and then we can have this conversation, blah, 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 and I could be your translator, blah, 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 and I was like, <sighs> okay, I feel the tides turning now, boys. I feel the tides turning, and Miss Froggy is going to be my partner in crime for the remainder of January, okay? So, there's that, and also, also, I just took a shot at some of these other streamers and I was like, hey, you know what? Here's a DM, and boom, responds back, okay? Responds back, will I say who? Maybe somebody, some people that rhymes with uh, Tangerenta, I don't know. <laughs> For example. <laughs> Friend. <laughs> uh, anyways, so content is coming, okay? Tonight, I actually have a small meeting with Miss Unicorn19 for dinner. I think she may be appearing on my stream. I'm not exactly sure. But also, uh, after I meet with Unicorn19, I'm going to be having a dinner with uh, Miss UEB, a.k.a. UTUB. And uh, that, I don't think, is going to be on stream. It's uh, just going to be like an off-stream dinner. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's the thing. So today I'm on my way, obviously, to do a nice little short stream to mostly have some time with the boys because you guys have not had a chance to talk to me that much because, you know, I've been very busy with a lot of collab streams and this is kind of like our, excuse me, bros day. But, um, do I know Crystal Joe? I don't. I know who she is, and here's the thing. Oh, Mr. Jake, though, thank you so much for the gifts up to Trisha. Is Trisha here? 
Is Trisha here? Oh, Trisha! Hey, what's up, Trisha? Trisha! How you doing, Trish? Um, it's, it's actually not that cold. The snow is just wet snow. And uh, I feel kind of gross. And for those of you guys that don't know this area, this is that same traditional old walk that I tend to like doing. And I figured since I gotta go over to um, Hongdae anyways, uh, Janky, today's not the day. Uh, be because I gotta go to uh, Hongdae anyways, why not take a look at how things have changed, okay? When I first came to Korea just a few months ago, or a few weeks ago, this street was all bland, dirty, short looking. I wasn't feeling the vibes. And for some reason today, now that I'm walking through, yes, it is a little bit wet, but the snow has made this a lot more of an enjoyable experience. Finally, maybe it's a sign that says, you know, winter doesn't make everything so bad. So I'm actually looking forward to my, the, the rest of my time here. Um, Trish, when am I going to be coming back to SoCal? I'm not sure. Maybe if I get nominated for a streamer award, maybe I'll show up, but... If not, then I'm most likely still going to just stay here in Asia for a little bit. Wenderella, thanks for the 11 months. Yo. Twitch Prime. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Um, anyways, so speaking of Miss Crystal Joe. So Crystal, I have actually stopped by in her chat a couple times. And I have been like, hey, so Crystal, sorry to bother your stream. I don't know if your viewership is mostly international or if it's Korean, but you know. Uh, maybe, uh, I, I don't know, I, I just asked that question and uh, I got zero response, so I have no idea about that one. I, I even sent an Instagram DM to kind of introduce myself, but it's kind of weird because she looks at my Instagram stories, but she doesn't respond to my... <laughs> I, I'm trying to help everybody, I have no clue. Um, so there's that, I have no idea. What category? Um, I mean, IRL streamer, but I'm not trying to win here. I'm just trying to get a nomination. So that's all that really matters. Also, this, this wetness is not helping my gear, guys. This wetness is not... Yeah. Tier 3, notify... <laughs> Look, I'm, I'm here to just help those that want to be helped. And I'm not going to go out of my way and beg these people to... You know, be like, hey guys, I, I know you want to stay on Twitch, but I'm telling you, I got the way. Uh, I'm not here to beg for them. Everyone's a fucking adult. If they don't want it, they don't want it. I'm not going to try more than, what, one one or two times? That's it. Uh, yeah, that, that being said, I have reached out to quite a few streamer friends of mine already. And hold on, I'm going to sit in some shelter real, real quick. Good morning! Dude, everything is getting hella wet. Not good! Not good! Was Trisha? Yeah, Trisha's uh, not getting, trying to get nominated for creative, creative streamer of the year. So if we could help her with that too, that'd be great. Does Crystal know anyone who can talk to her? I don't know. I don't care. Okay, I'm not... I'm not everyone's fucking savior here. I'm just James Bond, okay? Oh! Eh? My alerts are not working. J-Squiz, Xiaobei is not gonna beat you, so you don't need to freaking spam that message. Relax. Xiaobei, thanks for the raid, baby! Let's get a little shout out to my, my dear friend, Yoga Master Xiaobei. Uh, good morning. Long, oh, there long, we go. Long, long, long. You wish she beats you. You wish she beats you. Okay? You wish. You wish. She's not, she doesn't beat nobody. You, you wish she could touch you with 
her heel and kick you in the nuts or something. I don't know. That's your dream. We got Mr. Deadpool in the house. I was, uh, Deadpool, I was just giving a little update that uh, I'm going to be meeting up with Miss Froggy, like, on Tuesday. And, uh, we're probably going to be planning further adventures for the end of January. Maybe sometime in February, if I decide to stay here until the end of next month. So, I mean, today, guys, it's kind of like a little bit of an update stream. I'm, I'm giving you guys all the juice, the news of what's happening. And while you guys are putting me on your second monitor to listen to me kind of tell you what's going on, please click on the link, nominate me for IRL Streamer of the Year, and my friend Trisha is a birdie for Creative Streamer of the Year. That'd be fantastic. Please, please, please take like two minutes out of your day to do it. This is the last week to nominate Nominating streamers doesn't mean that they're going to win. It just means they're going to have a chance to win. Okay? T. Sean, thanks for the 19 hey, months. Hey, juicer, juicer. Uh, I should dance with her? Uh, I feel like I already have danced with her. Hold on. I mean, even if I get nominated, I don't really want to win. I... I Yes, I had a really good year. I mean, not a really... Like, I had a pretty good year last year, but I think, uh, obviously, Miss Ginny, she's been... She is a fuck. She is a monster. Okay, she... She has really transformed from um, GFE simulator streamer <laughs> to actual, like, bona fide like hardcore IRL monster streamer okay over the years the the transformation has been quite awesome to see and she's only getting more monstrous and I know in the beginning just saying hey just going out there and streaming every day anyone can do it but the reality is no they can't because if we could we would be doing it and obviously I'm probably as close to a, like a knockoff Ginny, but in male form as, as they come. But even I can't stream as much as she does. It's just impossible. But I'm also 10 years older than her, so I don't know. Maybe if I was her age and had the same kind of money, I, maybe I could do it. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, she's hella solo leveling, getting into, like, endgame status, all right? Yeah, and also, she has stronger legs than I do, okay? I am the Grandmaster of Collapse, I agree. Okay, anyways, so, today... No, 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 look, I might not win this year, but next year, for 2024 IRL Streamer of the Year, I am hands down gunning, I'm, I'm going for it, okay? And we're starting with a, with a strong Korea and Taiwan in March, baby. Okay? We got fucking content. Oh, my God. Okay, I was going to tell you. So, you know, TwitchCon has been kind of announced. Uh, TwitchCon EU is in Rotterdam. And uh, TwitchCon San Diego. But, uh, you know, a lot of us streamers for the past five years have been kind of talking about doing like why don't we get a show like a fucking amazing race like everybody's been talking about it but you know for me for the last year I'm like you know what why don't we just do it wait my brother what about my brother I was like why don't we just do it and pay for it ourselves and then use that to possibly get sponsors for the next time so, I'm thinking right now, uh, Hitch is not going to be the only one doing a, a Trek to TwitchCon. I'm going to try to get eight, eight of the top IRL streamers on board, and we're going to start building this out. And I think by, hopefully in the next couple weeks, I'm going to get everyone ready, and then I'll, I'll start building out the show. And we're just gonna fucking do it ourselves. Okay, we're just gonna do it ourselves. And hopefully, if my YouTube tr channel gets big enough, then we can use that to leverage 
and pitch to you know Amazon Prime or Amazon Originals or Netflix or something uh, or YouTube Originals. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You end up in, in Tijuana. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, already I talked to Mr. Jake and Big Live. He's down. So maybe Double Dragons, or maybe the Double Dragon will be a team, or maybe Jake's gonna go with Water. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what's more interesting. Uh, obviously, I gotta get uh, Mr. <laughs> Wait, he cooks. I cook. I adore you like family. You guys are fat. Okay, Trisha. Okay, dude. Um, obviously, Jay and Miochi's are a power couple. And they they know how to IRL travel, you know. So Miss Ginny is down. Like that's already five people. Okay, so is Cook sucks and Jay, uh, Jake and Bake Live gonna d team up Double Dragons? Would we? Would that be unfair of a competition, or is it gonna be Cook sucks and Ginny? I don't know. We'll see. Um, anyways, we're gonna get. I'm gonna try to get eight streamers to do this, and uh, that'll be fun. But that's not the important part of this conversation the important part of this conversation is what's going to be happening in the present time so today i am going to hongde i'm going to be meeting up with miss unicorn 19 uh she may make an appearance at the end of this stream before i have dinner with uh uni youtube and uh unknown mystery guest and we're gonna have dinner, and then maybe after dinner's over, I might stream again. I'm not sure, but I gotta have that conversation. Uh, you know, save Twitch Korea, that kind of thing. Uh, on Saturday, I have a collaboration with Miss Miochi. That'll be a fun stream. In my mind, I'm thinking we're gonna be going back to Buchun. And Buchun, I don't know if you guys remember, but Buchun was, is the city of Korean IRL streamers. So I wanna do some content over there with Miyochi, maybe show her what uh, Korean IRL streaming is all about. Uh, so that'll be fun. Sunday, I plan to go meet up with uh, streamer May. I don't know if you guys know who May is. <clears throat> Joe Dapo. Thank you, Yo. 51 months, baby. Buchon, Buchon, Buchon. When can you tell us what your plan is? I'm fucking telling you wow. what my plan is, you ding dong. What's so special about Puchon? Puchon is where all the Afrika TV IRL streamers are. Okay, so we're gonna try to make new friends there. Uh, yeah, May 5W, the travel IRL streamer. Okay, so she and I are gonna be meeting up Sunday or Monday, but I'm gonna be traveling over to a different town. Uh, who else? Next week. Who else is... Uh, I'm gonna be meeting up with Delphine sometime next week. You guys know Delphine? Delphine's another Twitch Korea streamer that has an international viewership. Uh, who else? You're going to love oh! this. Best. The heated vest. Shit. That was it. Listen, it's, to get the timing is not easy right now, okay? I was not expecting it. You're going to love this. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Why you always lying? Ah. This is fucking soaked right now. Korean police are coming. Oh, shut up. Oh, and you go. Ah, Okay, okay.
추워요, 추워, 추워. 추워, 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 추워. 추워, 추워, 추워. 40s making that milk shake. Bye bye. Okay. 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 Mr. Deadpool and all those motherfucking farters. Gotta respect the economy, right? <laughs> Maybe I uh, made them feel young again. Uh, I definitely feel much older now all of a sudden. But, uh, <clears throat> you know, guys, if you... Uh, were entertained even by the slightest from that very uncomfortable situation that I just had to physically endure while you guys got to watch. Please uh, nominate me for Best IRL Streamer of the Year Award. Click on the link uh, and uh, get, uh, vote for me. Vote for me. That'd be uh, <laughs> fantastic. And uh, where were we? Aren't I cold? Ah, uh, you know, sometimes the adrenaline and testosterone just kind of makes me forget about my body Post and my feelings. Gifted a tier one sub to F zero and says, "Right now, if anything, I am sweating, actually, but it's okay. Those ladies were like my. It was like my grandma, not like some stranger's grandma. That's like my grandma. So I feel very." Uh, I feel more comfortable in Korea because it's like my family. But if I was in a different country, maybe um, I'm like, oh, that's like Frank's grandma, and a little bit more shameful. But these Korean harmonies, they've gone through the Korean War time, so they've seen a lot worse. You know what I mean? They've they've ex they've experienced way way worse. Uh, Sage, thanks for the gift sub to Mr. Fontes and year, Sir Bagchild. Thanks for the 10 months, brother. Let me find a place to dump this trash. And uh, I'm going to continue explaining the plans for the rest of the week. Um, I will be meeting up with Delphine sometime. Who else? Uh, Amy Kim. I got to meet up with Amy. Uh, maybe Ming Ming sometime next week as well. Uh, who else? Uh, that's nice. Ooh, crazy. Ooh. Bonus food. Hell yeah, crazy. Thanks for the 2,000 bits, baby. Um, voted for me? Heck yeah, brother. Frago Nerd with a tier two. Thank CK you. CKSXP1, CKSXP2. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate you, brother. Appreciate you. Uh, am I gonna be meeting with Mumu? Oh yeah, I'll be meeting with Lucy. Yeah, May is on Sunday or Monday. Sunday or Monday or maybe both days, I'm not sure. Uh, I had to change my hotel reservation to kind of make it work out. Uh, Lucy, I'll be meeting with Lucy sometime. Anybody reach out to me that I've never heard of? You know what? Nobody actually has reached out to me first. 
Yeah, I'm gonna be going to Busse in sometime next next month. Uh, so I'll be meeting with Lucy, Ming Ming. I have to meet with Boss Barry again sometime soon, but I think Boss Barry and I want to do a trip in this somewhere like a different city, not in Seoul. So we gotta figure out uh, some day. What about? We gotta figure out some special day to do that, but right now it's just so difficult with all of these Seoul streamer meetups. Um, but that's gonna happen. Uh, what else? Maybe at the end of the month, I might be going to Taiwan for Iris's birthday for a few days. And Iris will be coming to Korea first week of January. So that's more IRL content right there. Jake though! Thanks for the gifts up to Miss Steffi. Jake underscore do for strict recruitment. <sighs> Jake underscore yeah, do give to the Boss tier Barry. one sub to Steffi TV underscore. Yeah. They have given 470 gift subs in the Thank channel. Thank you. Also, Chief Don Gambino, thanks for the five. Yeah, February. First week of February, sorry. Ooh, the snow is coming. Snow is coming. When will you meet Susan Sunq Lee on stream? Who's that? I have no idea who that is. Uh, who else? Who else? Who else? Who else is confirmed for meeting up like actual schedule times? Uh, Mumu, Momo, Momo. Okay, so Momo. Okay, let me tell you guys about Momo. Okay. Let me talk about Momo. Hey, Trisha with the gifts. Of, what the heck? Trisha is a birdie making that milkshake. Trisha, thanks for the 10 gifted subs, baby! Making that milkshake! Uh, what about Magenta? I, you must have missed out on the part where I says, I am speaking with a streamer whose name rhymes with Tangenta. Francenta. So, who knows? Hey, Hannah Banana! What's up, baby? How you doing? Uh, who else, who else, who else? Um... I know Miss L. Lee is going to be coming to Korea sometime in February. She really wants to do some IRL content together. I don't know what the heck that I, I could do with her, but that's going to happen. Uh, what else? Momo. Oh, speaking of Momo. So Momo, I was supposed to have lunch with Momo three weeks ago, like the day before Christmas. I think on the 23rd of December. And she was, she was like, oh, you, me, lunch, da 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 And I was like, okay, fine, I'll, I'll set aside a date to hang out. And fucking, freaking that day shows up, right? I'm, and I'm like, all right, well, when are we going to have lunch? She doesn't even respond to me. And I was like, I fucking set the day to hang out with you. What the heck, just at least get lunch. I could have streamed. I could have streamed. Um... Anyways, the day goes by, and then finally, at the end of the day, she was like, Oh, I'm sorry, Cook. Uh, I was sick. I had to go to the hospital, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, You're telling me at like 10 o'clock that you got sick? You could have just told me earlier? And then she posted on Instagram, like an uh, Instagram story that she was at the gym, and I was like, Is that a throwback picture, or is that you at the gym, and you just... <laughs> and then, so yesterday... I, you know, after like three weeks of not talking to her, I was like, I just sent an emote, like an emoji, like, like this. And she was like, Cook, we should hang out next time you come back to Korea. And I was like, I never left. I'm still here. <laughs> I was like, I'm still fucking here. It's like, oh, really? Let's meet up. And I'll come on your stream. <laughs> She's like, I'll come and be a guest on your stream. And I was like, yeah, of course you want to be a guest on my stream. Who the fuck doesn't want to be a guest on my stream? <laughs> petty. No, I'm not petty. <laughs> no, no, no. I, I, I'm just... I'm joking. I'm joking. Uh, not about not about anything, actually, but I'm just making light of the situation. Uh, wait, Hannah, I'm going to be in Korea most likely until the end of February and then afterwards I plan on going to Taiwan but it really depends if everyone in the chat 
votes for me for the IRL streamer award, then maybe I'll stay in Korea. But if nobody votes for me, maybe I'll have to cut this trip short just so that I can go and attend and go to this party so that I can make friends and get new viewers that would vote for me next year. Because my viewers don't do shit. So that's, that's the reverse play now, okay? Before I was like, oh, if you vote for me, maybe I'll go to LA to attend this award show, but now I'm changing my mind. I'm gonna go there so that I can get new viewers. The ones that would actually vote for me. Cause I need to win for 2024. Yeah. I'm gonna go for 2024 IRL stream of the year for real. This one, I just want a nomination. Blaming Chad? Yeah, I'm fucking blaming Chad. This is all based on Chad. This has nothing to do with anything. <laughs> uh, okay, so who else? If, if Hannah Banana's gonna show up, but the only problem with if Hannah Banana shows up, how the hell do you do an IRL stream with a VTuber that has... I mean, not even VTuber, but, uh, you know, AI girl with no face. Why is Bettle's name banned in here? Do I have to go through and explain? Rob does it? Yeah, but those those girls have all been, you know, they they kind of mask face reveal anyways, but Hannah Banana is definitely like secret. She's got an emoji face. Trust me, I've seen. Walk around with a tablet? Oh. No. Hannah Banana's got the best looking emoji face though, I will say. We like gossip? Brother, I'm not here to punch down, okay? I'm here to punch up. And the problem is me being as awesome as I am now, like, it's too crushing if I say anything bad about anybody. Okay, it's not good. It's not good image. Also, it's not good for the soul and karma. But, oh my god, can I say, ah, uh, I don't want to like bring this up, so I'm not going to go into too much detail, okay, but someone sent me a link of what this one streamer has said about me very recently, and I was just like, oh my god, this mother... Freaking liar. Oh, talk shit about Trisha. Trisha has bad breath. I'm kidding. Uh, I like Trisha. I love Trisha. Trisha's uh, one of my good, dear friends. I just wish I had more time to hang out with her. I'm just kidding, Trisha's breath is not bad. No, 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 no. Trisha, your breath is fine. Now you're gonna be hella paranoid. <laughs> she smells like roses? Yeah, yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that. Give some recall. <laughs> oh God, this snow. I just want to sit down and chat, like, I don't want to fucking walk around in the snow right now, but I gotta get to Hongdae to meet up with my friends. No! Well, I mean, I, I haven't stuck my nose in Trisha's mouth to verify if it smells or if it's good or not, so I, I'm not gonna... <laughs> Continue the story. What story? What was that? Um, Korea is more exciting. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Korea is more exciting because let's just say I think people are now like over the shock and all that stuff. And I have some meetings scheduled, uh, especially with some of these uh, yuck cam streamers who may predominantly look like they have. Uh, like a majority Korean viewership, but the reality is most of their Oilers are 
international viewers anyway, so that kind of qualifies them uh, to fall under my branch of assistance, you know what I mean? Why is the chat on the stream not showing any, any emotes? Uh, good question. I have no idea. Oh, I said someone was lying about me. Samo, shut up! You're just attracted to fucking pathetic drama. Go out and make your own drama in life. Gloves! I got gloves. I just had to take my shirt off, so long story. Don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to twitch.tv slash C-O-O-K-S-U-X. I'm Andy, a.k.a. Cook Sucks, and I'm your host with the mother flipping most. Most what? I'm not exactly sure, 100%, but uh, today's stream is kind of like a short, uh, let's just hang out with the boys stream. Uh, I've been doing a lot of collabs the past couple weeks. Oh. And, uh, you know, we haven't really had too much time to just hang with the with the gang. Uh, speaking of hang gang, no, who knows, maybe there's going to be a hang gang situation in the future sometime soon, but I'm not going to hold my breath. I'm not going to hold my breath. Uh, are most of them sticking around on Twitch? Yes. Some, no. And I don't think it is my responsibility to tell you guys which streamers are not staying on Twitch, but the only responsibility I have is if when are you gonna collab with Japan? He isn't cringe and more entertaining. I agree with you, brother. You, I don't know. When, whenever we're in the same country, uh, <clears throat> we'll find out in March who's gonna stay and who's not gonna stay. But uh, there's there's options. Like if streamers, okay. My my thing is my mission is really to help. Streamers with uh, more international, like with a sizable international viewership, because if they were to move to Africa or Naver, uh, unfortunately, international viewers don't have an easy time watching that content. And uh, their numbers wouldn't even be that great should they be forced to stream on those platforms. Like, let's be real, like if EXBC wanted to stream on Africa, it's not the same. It's better that they stay on Twitch. So, in that situation, for streamers like that, I have a solution. But for uh, streamers that are, you know, straight up Korean, Korean, um, I don't know who to use as an example. Like Sue Flower, for example, right? Probably better that they are on different platforms. But if they want to stay on Twitch, um, I don't know how much I can really help for that, but they can sign with an agency or something if they want to, and they can go that route too. I mean, there's there's so many options, um, but the only downside is if if Twitch were to pull out anyways and uh, IP ban the entire country, it doesn't even matter, right? So that's kind of the the issue. <clears throat> You just got here, how are the Korean streamers to stay on Twitch after February? Let me say this. It's none of your business. Don't worry about it. If you're not a Korean streamer, it doesn't affect you. They'll figure out the way. Don't be so curious. It doesn't matter what they do. As long as they stay on the platform. Who cares? Don't even bother asking. How come no one's asking how am I streaming? Why is no one asking me? Hey, how does your backpack work? How come you get to stream? How can you travel? No one asks me. No one cares about me. They only care about these fucking Korean streamers that they don't even read your chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you identify as a Korean streamer? How am I... Jesus. No one cares about us. Magic. How are you going to stream after February? Thankfully, I am a Twitch American streamer. Okay, so I'm good. 
You can run RL stream it streams via server off Korea. Not a big secret. Yeah, that's not this. That's nobody cares about how to do that. Everyone cares about staying monetized. Listen, I'm gonna tell Princess Anna. Says hi. Hannah's here. My princess. Um, listen. Everybody knows how to stream. No one's. No one's worried about being able to physically stream on Twitch. Nobody cares about that. That's easy. Anybody can do it. They're talking about staying monetized on Twitch. You ding-dongs. Okay, so once February 27 comes, any Korean streamer, okay, partnered, affiliate, or not, if you don't make any plans to change whatever you got to change, then your subscription button gets removed. You cannot receive bits anymore. You are basically streaming for free and only using Tunation and Twip. That's the problem. But nobody wants to stream for free. They cannot get ad money. They cannot get, yeah, all the emotes are gone because you cannot subscribe to them either. That's the issue. Nobody cares about actually using a VPN to stream on the platform. Even, even fucking the Twitch CEO has said that on the announcement stream. That's not a secret. Nobody has to have a fucking meeting to talk about that. You don't have to sign to an agency to sign up That's for nice. a VPN. Ooh. Cook. Good morning, brother. Very snowy there. Keep the balls Thank warm, you. bro. Hope you're Thank feeling you. good today and chat as well. Thank you. Yeah. So for everyone, it's like, well, everybody, that's, 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 not, that's not the, there's no secret. That's not the secret. The, the, they're trying to figure out how to, you know, stay on Twitch and stay monetized on Twitch. Does, is that, do you guys get that part now? Anyways, also check out youtube.com slash C-O-O-K-S-U-X. I have a new video out every Sunday. We just dropped a Thailand video. Very fun. That'd be great. I'd appreciate it. And I gotta dry my stuff. All my stuff is getting hella wet right now. Uh, okay. But, um, full disclosure, I am... Ah, yeah, thanks Deadpool, I appreciate you brother. I, oh, it stinks here, oh my, it stinks here, like Trisha's breath. Oh shit, it's so stinky here. You miss Froggy? Froggy's coming back soon. Don't worry, she's been streaming on Africa TV, okay? But she's coming back to Twitch. Uh, she'll be on my stream on Tuesday. You did hear rumors that Twitch might negotiate with the ISPs, but chances are slim. Uh, I cannot confirm nor deny that. There is no official news that I have been told about that uh, information, so I cannot say. Right now, it is speculation, and um, that much, I'm not a man for assumptions. I'm only a man of fact, okay? So I don't want to make false promises and claims on theories but we don't know anything about that part twitch it's not like twitch is going to call me up and be like hey cook uh just letting you know um while you're in korea mr mr cook sucks korean american irl streamer friends with most of the international community just want to let you know, spread the word. Here it is. How are monetized the Chinese streams because Twitch doesn't exist in China? Uh, because they're Twitch Americans in China, you weirdo. It's like me. I'm a... Twitch American streamer, and I'm in Korea physically, but I'm not relegated to Twitch Korea rules. I'm just Twitch NA. So all of proceeds are as if my channel 
is operating out of California. That's why I pay USA California tax, okay? Because my business operates out of California. Technically, my server that I stream to is in Los Angeles, California. My business, my server is located in California. It's just the content that's being streamed to that server just happens to be in a different country. Literally, I am not getting paid by Korean people in one. I'm not taking any jobs in Korea by Korean companies. I'm not, I'm just a tourist. I'm just a tourist and, I'm, and my work is just to myself and this is not a job like that. <clears throat> Streamers in China get paid by Chinese government. <laughs> Oh shit, I gotta go somewhere else, not here. I'm in Hongden now. I gotta meet up with Unicorn19 in about an hour and a half, two hours from now. So I wanna go check out this one store before I get there. Come on. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. So that is the issue with these agencies popping up fast after Twitch closing. Wait, that is the issue? Wait, what's the issue? Uh, I'm not looking super hard. I'm looking for those people that have no one to help them. You know what I mean? Like some streamers, they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna choose whatever agency or business or whatever they want and they can do that. They're a grown adult. I'm not here to, I'm just here to give an option, right? There's many options out there. There's many options, but some people, maybe they're not friends with the right people or whatever, so they don't have that line of communication. And that's who I'm here to help, everyone else. Also the actual really top streamers to still make Twitch some money too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, Twitch still needs to get paid, you know, and I'm a, I'm a corporate shill at the end of the day. Sounds like a massive opportunity for monopoly in Korea. Yeah, dude, protectionism at its finest. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, 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 sorry. Should I find like a little umbrella for my camera? Maybe I should do that. I'm sorry, it's, it's the the nature of the weather, okay? Like I said, today's stream's more of a conversation stream. And, um, yeah, I, I'm, I'm happy to say, like, a lot of people's vibes are much better uh, overall because they are finding their way. But again, there's definitely some streamers that just need another option and tell them to feel free to contact me. Oh, oh, oh ah, ah, ah. this is what I was gonna talk about. So, somebody had sent me a clip where uh, somebody was like, oh, hey, Cook Sucks is in Korea trying to help some streamers. And this fucking streamer, I'm not gonna mention their name, but they called me racist. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, shit. I gotta, I gotta send UEB the address to this dinner place. Yeah, man. It's pretty bad. 2024 exposed them. Dude, their career is dead in the water anyways. 
and I don't want to I don't want to mention any names and give them more publicity okay just say who it is no Wait, where the fuck is this restaurant say it in Korean cart rider no Eh, hey, Yeah, they said I was racist to uh, about Again, it's like, uh, she was saying that, like, oh, okay, fuck, how do I say this? The, the things they were, she was talking about is so bizarre because they had an issue with another streamer, right? And, yeah, you think I have drama with men? Men are fucking normal, okay? Men are fucking normal. Anyways, so she has said on stream that I had gone out of my way to contact her for something and said all these things. And at the end of the day, she goes, but you know, this other girl streamer, even though I had problem with her, I'm also a woman, so I am on her side, blah, blah, blah. And I was just like, hold on a second. Let's rewind time. And I have the fucking receipts about this anyways, okay? Let's rewind time. She had an issue with another streamer, okay? And then that this girl tried to beg me, okay? Real cat, thanks for the four months. She tried to beg me to have a Discord call with her. And I was like, okay, I'll talk to you. Let's have a chat. All right. And and then she's saying, all these, uh, uh, you know, we're both Korean people. You should help me because we're Korean and uh, this and this. And I'm just like, dude, I don't. And she kept on saying, oh, yeah, but you're her boyfriend, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, I'm not her boyfriend. I don't know what you're talking about. Um... You know what I mean? Like, I'm just like, she's just making all these claims and I'm just like, dude, I don't know how to help you. Like, that's none of my business. And then she starts yelling at me and then blocks me. And I'm just like, okay, that's weird. Fine. I, I don't know what else to do about that. But the way that she phrased it is she saying that I'm, oh my God, I, Obviously, did not be somebody's boyfriend because I don't like dark-skinned people or dark-skinned girls. When I was like, uh, I fucking don't care about skin color. I love tight bodies. And I'm not actually uh, afraid to say that. And I think I'm pretty dark-skinned myself. You know what I mean? Like, aren't I pretty dark skinned for a Korean person? So I guess I'm racist to myself? Yeah? And uh, if anything, she was the one making racist comments by saying we're Koreans, we should stick together and not this quote unquote, oh, 
I don't want to say the words, the racist version of, let's say Chinese in Korean. Oh, but these, you know, like she was, she would just be, I'm like, you're fucking crazy. I, I don't care about that stuff. And I love, I love Chinese girls. Okay, I'm just saying. I love all girls. I don't know. I'm 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 crazy. And and uh, what else she made in the in the in the in the slander piece against me was she said that I was when I was having this phone conversation with her, which first of all, think about the context of this conversation. I had bragged to her that I slept with every female streamer that I collaborated with. And here's the thing. I wish I was that much of a Casanova and I may have hooked up. Okay, Dr. Drill, thanks for the 52 months. I Cooks may up have hooked toys. up with Shush. a few. Let's avoid another band boop head lol. Thank you. But I would not want to brag about it because that is kind of a secret. You know what I mean? That's not something. Because if I brag about it, then no one's going to hook up with me. And second of all. Okay, hold on. Second of all. This phone conversation happened in 2019. I literally only streamed with one female. So why would I brag about, how can I brag about female collaborations when I only did one? Hey, Digital Ninja, thanks for the 20. Cook hooked up with Jake, confirmed. No, I'm just saying, it doesn't make sense. This is a phone conversation in 2019, not a 2023, oh. 2024 conversation. If this was 2023 or 2024, maybe it would make sense. But this is from 2019. <laughs> I don't know, she, she has backtracked and really put the target on me when I had nothing to do with this period. That the drama was between her and another female, not me. But I became the enemy here. I think I'm pretty open with, you know, my, uh, whatever, scandals. I'm pretty open about most of this shit. And, uh, literally, no one. I have streamed with hundreds of female streamers at this point. Okay? I have literally streamed with hundreds of them. If I was legitimately, uh, uh, you know, uh, a negative person off stream, like, I'm, I'm, I'm being dead serious. If I was le le legitimately uh, that person, either two options is... Here. One, every fucking female streamer is a liar and only are using me for clout, which I don't think is the case. Or number two, maybe the person saying this is lying because everyone else literally says I'm the nicest guy that they've met off stream. And nobody has heard me brag about sleeping with girls because I'm trying to keep that a secret. What does her name start with? Uh, let's just say her name rhymes with uh, Chiliani Lee. What a fucking bozo. Okay? What a fucking bozo. I, I literally even came here to be like, hey, if she needs help, I'll fucking help her. I'll squash whatever beef she has with me, even though I don't have that much beef with her. I don't care. But... But that's what she wants to do. But okay, whatever. Hey, what up, baby shoe? Baby shoe was around during this time. I didn't do shit. Yeah, she blocked me after she tried to do some racist conversation to me. <laughs> what up, baby? Baby shoe was around during 2019 time period, okay? Baby shoe. Can you tell my chat, am I a man whore that sleeps with every female streamer that I collaborate with? I mean, you are a female streamer that have collaborated with me, right? Jake underscore do for strip recruitment. Jake underscore who gifted a tier one sub to baby 2888. 
They have given 471 gift subs in the channel. Trisha is a birdie. Nice. Ooh. Can I say it? No, you can't say it. Jake, no, thanks for giving. Miss Trisha is a birdie is in the fucking chat too. Did I? I don't know what to say. Anyway, so I saw that clip and I'm like, wow. I I have held on to the contents of that Discord phone conversation in my brain for five years and I never once tried to throw her under the bus for the crazy shit she did. But I'm gonna tell you, she tried to leak this phone conversation by saying that I am one racist to dark-skinned Asian girls, which doesn't fucking make sense because I myself am a dark-skinned Asian man and I just love tight bodies. It doesn't matter what color you are. Uh, number two, that I bragged about sleeping with every collaboration girl that I've had, even though I, at that time, in 2019, I've only collaborated with one female streamer. And uh, number three, I don't even know what else. That I tried to reach out to her. And like I said, I have the receipts of her begging me to have a Discord call with her. She said, Cook, can you please help me? Please help, please help. Can you call me, Cook? Please help me, please help me. I'm getting triggered right now because it's like, people could say whatever the fuck they want about me, I don't care. But if it's an outright lie, that's bogus, dude. Hide the lies in the truth? Huh? Take her to court? Listen, I'm not here to punch down and... I already have a court case, a court situation I'm dealing with right now. <sighs> and anyways, it's like, um... There's no actual damages. She has like two viewers. What the fuck am I supposed to do about that? I don't care. Huh, one of those two viewers must have been the one that sent me the fucking clip. You fucking, that fucking guy probably baited that shit out of her. Oh my God. She was a view butter? Dude, she used to brag so much about how she stream collab with Jake and Bake Live, and I was like, I don't care. Oh, but I streamed with Jake. I streamed with Jake. I streamed with Jake. I don't care. Good for you? Nice? I mean, I guess in 2019 or 2018, Jake was like top shit, but like, so what? Do you think that matters to me? She's stupid. She was just talking about how she could marry her brother's friend so she can keep her Twitch and say she's boring and his mom is crazy. Yeah, she had a lot of drama with a lot of viewers uh, that she dated. All right, I don't fucking know what to say. I don't care anymore. Okay, so she she has, uh, didn't she have like a big drama with some police officer that she dated that was a mod of hers? I don't fucking know. No, she didn't have keys to my apartment. Yeah, I said it, I don't care, so what? What is that, an open secret? And then, and then, and then after the oiling is done, she's gonna ban him from the community? I wonder where they all disappeared to. Oh, they're all banned. Maybe that's why there's no viewers left and no money coming in. Because once you suck all the juice out, you ban them. <laughs> yeah. 
Anyways, I was trying to be nice for a long time, and then when I saw that shit, like I said, I, I'm pu- I'm hella punching down. I shouldn't be doing this, but fuck it. She has she has clips that have millions of views. I don't care. Technically, she's more famous than I am. <laughs> I guess there's a punch up. Yeah, that's a punch up. Uh, I'm a real streamer. I stream with Jake and Bake live, so you should listen to me. My, my, I used to work for a Korean drama writer, very famous, ones awards, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, I don't care. What does that have to do with me? How can I help you? What am I supposed to do? Oh, tell this girl to do this and this and this. I'm like, I don't know her. I mean, she, listen. Miss uh, Shmilani, if you're watching the stream, okay? First of all, you have a chance, okay? Fix your brain for once, and I can help you. And number two, I have no beef with you, okay? You're a little crazy, but I have no beef with you. I have no problem with you. You should fix your problem with that other girl, not with me. With me, I'm fine, okay? And number three, stop with all the lies. Just grow up. Okay, you're an, we're adults now. You're 42 years old now, okay? Grow up. Let's relax. If anything, I can help you with your fucking stream. I don't know. All right, you don't have to date stream viewers anymore, okay? You could just actually do it on your own for once in your life. Okay? Stop saying lies about other streamers. Grow up a little bit. And uh, finally... If one girl likes me a lot, it doesn't mean they're my fucking girlfriend. Okay? I can say right now, I fucking have a huge crush on IU, the singer, the K-pop singer. I think she's cute, she's adorable. Man, I would love for IU to meet my family. I can say that to you all I want, but does that mean that I am IU's boyfriend? Use your brain. Please. If some girl says, oh my god, I love Cook Suck, blah, blah, does that mean they're my girlfriend? You know how many girls love me? Cook, can you make a snow cone for chat? We're hungry. Great credit. It's fucking cold right now and that my hands are sweat. Okay? Use your brain. She's talking about some shit that happened in 2019. Okay? No, no, no. I didn't compare myself to IU. I'm just saying it's the concept. Saying that you like somebody and you have these dreams and you really love somebody doesn't mean you're dating them. Jake underscore do volunteer ten dollars. Thank you, Jake, for the ten buccarinos. Hold on, is that media share? Oh, my media show is blocked. Hold on. Literally five years ago. Oh, what's this? Cooksucks didn't like her because she's dark skinned. Uh, how about I didn't like the fact that she's crazy and wouldn't leave me alone and couldn't let me breathe. And if I tried to hang out with Baby Shoe, she'd be like, don't hang out with Baby Shoe and just argue with me for like six months or like I'm not allowed to raid streamers like Minx Kitty. I'm like, I can fucking raid whoever the fuck I want. You're not my boss. Or maybe like, stop trying to make me be your boyfriend. Like, can I just relax and chill? There's reasons. And it has nothing to do with skin color. Okay? I don't know what to say to this. It's like, use your brain, logic. Yeah, here's the thing. So I can say all these things now, because I know, hopefully, in the next several weeks, this court thing is gonna close and 
After that's done, I can't talk about this anymore. Six dollars. Once this court shit is done, I can't talk about it anymore. So I'm gonna fucking say everything now. Am I the sociopath? Yeah, I am a little bit crazy. But, um... Pause for one second. If I'm the sociopath, then everybody else on Twitch that has met me and is still my friend, they are all also sociopaths. Or maybe... Maybe it's not the 99% of everyone else. Maybe it's the 1% of the people making these weird claims that are the crazy ones. You know what I mean? What are the chances? Is it always everyone else, not me? Or is it me that's the problem? Maybe think about that, Miss Shmiani. Please. How come it's always everyone else, never you? No, no, I'm not, I'm not, Air Bomb, I'm not, I'm not talking about uh, Shmiara Shmidi, I'm talking about Shmiana Shmi, okay? Shpiara is already that 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 is already done and over with. Okay, she's already fucked up everything. Who cares about that shit? Okay, Miss Shmiani, however, I never talk about her because I try to be a nice guy. But now, uh, sometimes, sometimes even kings have to chop some heads off, right? Nominated you. Cooksucks the crazy psychopath racist streamer. Uh, how come he's collaborating and meeting up with all these other streamers on Twitch? Oh, it can't surely be because only club. Meanwhile, I'm sitting at home. Nobody wants to stream with me. Nobody. What was the last streamer friend that you've had in like four years? Hmm. Four years. Oh yeah, you streamed with Jake and Bake Live in 2018. Sorry.
Listen. Don't. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, shit. There was a media shit that I fucked up. Uh, mods. Can you put that last one back in the queue? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I pushed the skip button on accident. It was DJ's media share, sorry. I'm gonna have a, I'm gonna take you guys to this spot. I saw it on Instagram uh, earlier today and I was like, ooh, I want that. Yeah, it was the media share by DJ. You're evil, you're not evil, just petty. I'll take that. <laughs> I'll take that, dude. I know the best response is no response, but, uh, you know, my personality trait is, uh, my tolerance for holding certain things in is as small as a thimble, okay? I, I'm very impulsive, okay? What's the consequence for me? Nothing. What am I gonna do? Get canceled by 10 viewers? Those guys already probably don't like me anyways because I'm streaming with their favorite girl. I don't know. Must be, must, must, must feel like shit when the girl that you simp for on stream considers me as a friend. Why did I hold for so long? Because. Because. I was just like, it's not my, it's not my issue. I never knew that she uh, transformed and tried to rewrite the story the way that she did. Oh yeah, I forgot. She used to work for a top K drama writer, producer. That's why. Everything's so dramatic with this person. And don't worry, this VOD is not going to disappear anytime soon. All right? Again, I said I'll be the bigger person. I will help. Ooh. Slippery. Okay, travel, travel maker. Let's go.
because uh, viewership is mostly Korean, so I can have lunch, but I can't save her. Sorry. Sorry, Chodan. Magenta, however, different story. Oh, that's her ex-boyfriend. Oh, she's dating an actor now? See, you guys know better than I do. I don't, I don't know. How many girlfriends do I want? You got many girlfriends, okay? Who are these people? I use the singer. Singer celebrity. Actress. Superstar. Uh, New Balance. New Balance spokesman girl. One a day. No, I don't want girlfriends. I don't want girlfriends. If you don't mind me asking, what do you spend on month of rent in Seoul? Good question, brother. All right, dude, we gotta pause media share right now. Twisted, I gotta get inside this restaurant. Again? Dude, my hands fucking freezing. Twisted, thanks for the five bucks. <sighs> Anyways. Unless if I have to, I think that's the end of that drama segment. Ah, thanks for being with me. Oh, I'm sure. Yep, yeah, some of that. Okay. Oh, shit, I'm not gonna be hungry for dinner. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Anyways, this is probably like the one place in Seoul that I can get like an actual American breakfast. American breakfast all day, baby. Okay. Fuck, 15 bucks for a pancake combo, what the hell? I didn't, I didn't eat anything all day today, but I have dinner at like 7.30, so. <sighs> Fuck it. Uh, now I feel guilty, dude. I shouldn't have said anything. That was, that was, that was too, too much of a, that was too, too much. Hey, Eric, thanks for the Twitch Prime, baby. That was too much. I went too hard on that, man. Oh well. Oh! Yeah, yeah. Delete. I'm not deleting the vlog. I'm just gonna get an Obama breakfast. it again in my hotel oh my God. yeah it was mostly the racist part okay I actually it was mostly every part about it it was all just fake news Breakfast is two white toast, scrambled eggs, two pork sausages, and hash browns. Oh! Julio! Ah! Just a quick 
Uh, can I change or, or, or can I add two bacon? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check out the cash for you. Thank you. No, I, I want the white toast. Thank you for that. Cook definitely wouldn't ever go to Southeast Asia for those girls. Wait, what? Shouldn't it be one white toast and one dark toast? <laughs> no, 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 no. It's uh, Obama breakfast. Okay, thank you. Imposter Chew. Thank you, baby. Oh, you got a gift stuff from Moondog. Thanks, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a... Uh, Pancake combo, but I got the Obama breakfast because I, I I don't want French toast, pancakes, or waffles. I think that's gonna make me too full. Even though my I gotta meet with Uni in like two two hours. I'm racist because I picked white toast and not dark toast. What the fuck? Also, now that I think about it, let's just say, what if that part is right? And I'm like, yeah, I only like light-skinned girls. Is that bad to have a preference? Oh, fuck this. Hold on one second. It's a preference, not a racist, but I'm a racist, I guess. Dude, when I was in freaking Yummy's chat, somebody... <laughs> I can't... First of all, I don't... I don't. Yeah, it's such a Korean thing. I'm a fucking American, dude. I'm an American. Um... Ah, whatever. That's the story. That's the drama story. Yeah. Is the Barack Obama meal just chocolate? Night? What? What if girls don't like happen to be light skinned? Am I a racist? No, you're. It's just like uh, a lot of you guys. You guys want to date Asian women. Is that racism? I don't think so. It's maybe fetishism, I guess. Hold on, let me, um... You only like hot women. <laughs> yeah, that's true, dude. Oh my god, all my gear is wet as fuck. Personal preference for yourself is not considered as racism. Hey, you know what? Yeah, girls like rich dudes, it's preference. Girls like dudes that are six foot three. Is that, a th is that racism? Yeah, here's the thing. I guess living rent free in people's heads, pretty good for me. You know what I mean? That's what I'm saying, fuck these, dude. I, you guys, if you guys looked at my, my porno folder, okay, my porno folder, you guys will see I am very, um, eclectic with my taste, but is that racist? I don't know, is that racist too? Like, I really like 
I really like um, like a lava cake with whipped cream on it. I think it's hot AF. Lava cake. And that's as dark as you can get. <laughs> Confectionery sugar? I don't know. Yeah. Suppy Ralphie. Thanks, brother. Put a gift sub. Listen, sometimes I watch white girl porn. Sometimes I watch Asian girl porn. Sometimes I watch black girl porn. Sometimes I watch brown brown girl porn. It just depends on the week. You know, it's like, ooh, what am I craving today? Are we gonna be watching some blurry jav? Okay, today's a jav day. Today's a little angel day, okay? Today's a stepsis, you know? Hot milf teaches, uh, moms teach sex day. Okay, I don't know. Sometimes it's a nubiles day. Sometimes it's a Nubian queen day. I don't fucking know, it's just, I like buffets, all right? It's like, a, it's like going to a buffet. Some days you want steak, some days you want just pizza. Hot okay. Yeah, baby, uh, look at this. Okay, this, this block of butter is just... Sometimes it's a Dane Jones day. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna have a light dinner tonight. Dude, I still have like this one very favorite Dane Jones video. It's, um, Sister's Boyfriend Cream Pie with I Iwia. The dude's sleeping and the, the sister comes by and starts like pulling his underwear off and she just goes to town. She's like, the guy wakes up and is like, oh, what are you doing? You shouldn't be doing this. Your sister. Don't worry, she's not going to know. inside me. When is that gonna happen to me? Mmm. I haven't had like an American breakfast in a long time. Racist streamer seek steps is? I don't know, man. I think. I think sometimes streamers are insane and they forget that everyone is watching. And anybody can make clips at any time. And sometimes they should. They should not say anything unless if they have receipts. You know what I mean? 
If you're gonna make a claim, have some receipts. This is a post hashtag Me Too era where too many women just make so many fake claims. Have some receipts, dude. I got them. I wonder how scared and worried Shmiani would be if she found out that I actually recorded that phone conversation. Hey, Saxton Goro! Ah! Thank you! Hey, my, my alerts are not working right now. Hey, Elise, I was just talking about you. Speak of the devil, dude. Speak of the devil. Hey, what up, Ellie? Hey, uh, ladies and gentlemen, first of all, shout out to Ellie, okay? Um, Raiders, welcome to the stream. I'm Andy, aka Cook Sucks, IRL streamer from Los Angeles, California. I'm here in Korea, even though you might not believe me because I'm eating a good old fashioned Obama breakfast, all right? But uh, I'm in Hongdae for a little bit because I got to meet up with some friends tonight. And we're just doing like a little uh, homie to homie content. Please follow my stream. Don't worry, I'm going to stream with a bunch of hot girls for the next couple weeks. I, I think Elle wants to stream in Korea together when she comes in February. She guarantees that I'm going to get four, 4K viewers. So I'm going to hold her to that, all right? Excuse me. Masculinity? Wait, what? I'm a holder to that. Let's think of some content, but anything except going to like an animal cafe, please. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this sausage is awesome. She's gonna be like, oh my god, can we go to like Pongdaemun and wear Hanbok? Can we go travel to the fucking palace, please? Can we go to the zoo? Can we go to the arcade? Uh, no. I don't want to do that content, bro. That's what every IRL stream. That's what every newbie beginner IRL streamer does for like the first two years. I've been doing this for five and a half. That kind of content is boring as fuck to me. Okay. Theme park. Look, L. Just tell me you don't have any friends, and then I will come and hang out with you, and we can go to like Lotte World together, but we can't stream that shit. It's not streamable. But if you want to hang out and do it, then let's go. All right, I'll do it. I'll keep you company. I'll, make, I'll be your friend. <laughs> will, will I wear a uniform? Yeah. Hell yeah. I've, I've done it before off stream. I mean, you can you can stream it. I, I I can't stream it because I got this whole fucking backpack set up. But you can bring your cell phone to stream it. For like yucky joy kunyo, like uh, my sassy girl. Dude, L, don't take this the wrong way, but I hope you like eating cow asshole. Because I'm gonna take you to eat some kopchang, okay? It's my favorite. And I don't mean that in a, like, weird sexual way, okay? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, it's not that old people like Kopchung, dude. Girls love Kopchung. Mm. Mm. I got too far. Let's go get some Kopchung when I come back. 
Mm -hmm. Dude, this toast is good. What the hell? Yo, this is some good strawberry jam. What the hell? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Visit that bridge over the Han River in Seoul where a lot of people... Why would I want to jump? Go to a bridge where people jump off. That's kind of weird. Um, no, L, this is uh, it's a restaurant called Travel Maker and they serve American breakfast all day. And I fucking love American breakfast. I haven't had good old fashioned American breakfast in months. So I was craving it, I wanted to have it. And like I said, today's stream is like a just a chill, homies, just hanging out. What do you mean? This Obama breakfast, it's like $10. You know the Korean won to USD is pretty bad, or pretty good. Is it better than American American? I think it's comparable. I would say that this is just as good, if not, maybe quality is a little bit better than Denny's, but portion size is small. The sausage is good. Big loop, thanks for three months. Now it's like 20 bucks. Dude, inflation for food, crazy. Yeah. I mean, I paid uh, $1 extra to get bacon. Someone was joking about the me getting the Clinton breakfast, but I feel like if I order the Clinton breakfast, the FBI is going to be on my ass. I'm not really into sucking the adenochromes off of little children, okay? Adenochromes from the children, Pizzagate, it's real. <laughs> comes with a cigar. Comes with a cigar and a side of ten-year-old. Uh, this was on Epstein's island. Bacon's good, man. What the hell? Dude. 2024, I feel like so much shit is gonna go down. The Epstein list gonna go fully public. Everyone's gonna go down, and I can't wait to see it. No more haven media safety for all these corrupt old people that are taking advantage of kids. Get rid of all of them. Am I planning to come to Australia? Yeah. Get them all. Get them all.
Yeah, Diddy. Take him down too. Cat Williams opening the, the doors, baby. We need a Thailand cook arc? Dude, I've done a lot of Thailand cook arcs. There's 65 plus photos of Trump and Epstein together? Take Trump down too then, I don't fucking care. Take them all down. Take down Bill Gates, the man who's trying to fuck our food and destroy all the rainforests. Dude, 50 Cent is the man. <laughs> If you're at a ditty party, you gotta watch your front and your back. <laughs> Ron Swanee dropped out? What the hell? is back in rehab for porn addiction okay what is a porn addiction exactly have I ever done the Philippines yeah 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 station I went to the Philippines in 2019 before the phone calls or no, after the phone calls Chelsea was in the book as well I mean, Kanye's wives all look like porn stars. That means he's racist. Hey, we're unstoppable. Thanks for the 10 months. Hold on. Jab is not actually Japanese, it was originally made from America. That's the thing, all the, all the quote unquote Jab that's made outside of Japan is the best because you can see the, you can see the details. You know what I mean? And I know Esco's a man of mosaic and censorship because it in increases the imagination, but to be honest, I like the details. It makes my imagination better. You know what I mean? Like I, I'm putting my face. It's like my brain is a supercomputer, and I'm doing a face swap with my face on the penis, and my face is getting that penis. Wait, no, no, no. That's no, no. My face is on the guy's penises. Not not my face on the girls getting the penis. No, not 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 that way. But I'm I'm the one. Can't okay, forget it. What the heck is going on with my camera? What a BV. BV Nuna. Hey BV. Uh, I don't know if L is still here, but L is just here. What up? What up, baby? How you doing, Gloria? Can I repeat the topic again? Uh, I don't know where it cut out. I don't know. I think I think my screen just censored me. I think my screen just censored me. like something on my face. I was just imagining myself doing the thing and then sometimes I'm like, oh, 
if I um, not not that I'm not that my face is sucking the thing, but sometimes sometimes it's kind of like watching you know like John Wick, and I'm imagining I'm John Wick, and I'm killing like twenty thousand people in one go. But it's not me. It's just sometimes my imagination, or like sometimes I'm imagining eating. Food Fighter Challenge, like 100 hot dogs in one sitting. Like I'm imagining that's me. So sometimes I'm, I imagine like I'm the guy who's putting his pee pee inside the, the other man's butt, or I mean um, the other girl's butt, or whatever. Or sometimes I'm sucking on the dick, but it's like for like two seconds because I'm not choosing to imagine that. But sometimes the brain just does whatever it does because the brain is a mysterious device. You know what I mean? Like we can't control what our brain thinks of sometimes. And sometimes I can then think of making cakes. Don't act like I'm the crazy one. Wait, hold on, my chat app is broken right now. Okay, so hold on. So imagine I'm the, no, I can imagine everything. Like, okay, guys, don't you sometimes imagine it's like, oh man, what if I am that girl and I'm getting that cock just in my pussy and it is making my leg shake? You know what I mean? Like if I was a girl, and like, do I feel full? Like my stomach is full when I ate too much food? You know what I mean? Like, you know, you know when you eat too much food, you're just like, oh, I feel full as fuck. Like, does that feel full in the pussy area? Like, it's like, you know, or is it just more like, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just curious. I'm curious. But it's, it's not like I think about it for hours, like maybe like 10 seconds. You know what I mean? It's just like 10 seconds. Whatever, man. Sometimes I think I'm playing baseball. I don't know. My brain is crazy. You guys don't think of just, you know, like uh, intrusive thoughts sometimes. I'm not crazy. Or like, what if I was a pro track driver or if I was in the Olympics? Or like, what if I was that girl's pair of shorts and my face is like right in the butt crack? And I'm like, is it, am I gonna like it? Or is it gonna be too smelly? I don't know. Like those yoga pants that they wear and then it goes into the crack. And I'm like, oh, but you're getting, like you're rubbing the poo all day. You know what I mean? Like you're just rubbing poo on the fabric. Or like, like Pickle Rick. Like what if you're like Pickle Rick and then you have your face on a pickle and then it goes inside a vagina or a butthole and then you're like, oh, I can't breathe. It's so smelly. It's super smelly. Like what if your dick had a nose and and the thing is your your dick, the nose on your dick doesn't talk to your brain. So it's like a separate character, and then every time you do sex stuff, then your brain is, your dick is like, no, not again, please, don't put me in there, it smells bad. But we don't care because we're not connected in that way, like what if the dick has a brain? You know what I mean? It's like, no, not again, oh, stinky, stinky. Two hundred people just left. It's only getting I eat. Dude, this breakfast was good. Would 
you rather have dicks as fingers or fingers as a dick? I mean, here's the thing. My penis is already kind of like a finger. Like a really thick man's finger. So... I'll take the fingers and the finger dick because it's not that different. And also, then, then if I had a finger dick, then it can go like this. Instead of just like that, you know? You guys know what I'm talking about, shut up. Uh, isn't my finger crooked? Yes, my dick is curved like a banana. Okay, so what? That's only when it's hard. When it's soft, it's like a shrunken little banana sausage. No. Oh, okay. Nine eight eight zero. Okay, come something that. Nine eight eight zero star. Ow. Fuck. Ow. I'm a hundred percent grower. Oh my god. Can I have this conversation with you guys? Check out my 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 ankle is really not good right now. Ugh, going downstairs is rough. <laughs> Three points of articulation on the penis. Oh. Got an oj. Down it, tra do do something for me for uh, chocolate. I know that, that sounded very weird, but would you? I'm, I'm, you want to see their reaction? <coughs> that was quick. Listen, I have a small bladder. I I feel uncomfortable when I have small pee pee. I mean small pee in my pee pee hole. Okay? <sighs> she asked if I wash my hands? Why would I wash my hands? My pee pee's cleaner than my hands. <sighs> Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Twitch. Also, the TV slash C O O K S U X. Toy in the moon, Andy Mina, aka Cook Sucks. And today I'm in Hongdae, just having a nice little short stream. I'm meeting my friend Miss Unicorn 19 in about one and a half hours. And I will be having dinner with my friend UEB later tonight and another secret friend. Uh, unfortunately, some of that is not going to be on stream. 
So I'm just kind of passing the time. I was giving some updates of what's gonna happen on the stream and uh, you know, just kind of have some fun with the boys before uh, we have a full week of content. Uh, I was talking about basically all of the collaborations that we have booked up for the next two, three weeks and it's quite a lot. Also, I am gonna be meeting another streamer Former streamer, I don't know if she wants to meet off stream or on stream though, but do you guys remember uh Jake underscore do volunteer ten dollars? Do you guys remember what was her name? Her streamer name, something Sonical? I think UB knows BJ Winter Fanny Pack.
Two years ago, when I first came to Korea, uh, not three years ago, four years ago? Shit, I don't know. Back in 2020, when I first came to Korea, I uh, spent two weeks in quarantine because this was during the COVID days, right? And as soon as I got out of COVID, I did a stream where I was walking from the Seoul station to Hongdae, okay? And that was because my original place of stay was an Airbnb here in Hongdae. And right now, I'm going to show you guys that Airbnb place. That was such a scam, shitty place to stay for... I had booked it for one month. I think about one month. It was such a... Ever since then, I'll never do Airbnb in Korea again. Never again. And it was right here. This used to be like a rocket chicken spot. But, oh no, this was the rocket chicken spot right here. But my Airbnb was, you had to go, th oh. They're going there right now. Right here, up on the top floor. You go on the top floor and it's like a small little apartment. Yeah, and the thing is, like, it was so freaking humid. Uh, there was condensation everywhere. It was a very small room. Uh, the rules, the quiet rules, the bathroom was the fucking shower. It was in here. It was in here. And um, I remember I was doing some file transferring, like, of my old VODs to this hard drive of mine. And I accidentally tripped over my hard drive cable, like the power cable and it knocked my hard drive on the ground and I lost two years worth of VODs because that hard drive got wiped <clears throat> anyways that was, that was th this is where I stayed for one month here in Hongdae and then after that never <laughs> after that never again hotels only after that even though in the first couple years like I couldn't really afford it but uh, thankfully, in 2020, uh, hotels were pretty cheap because of COVID. And also, like, I didn't stay in Seoul that long, actually. I, I did a lot more city travel, uh, inner city, inner country travel. So the smaller cities, each hotel night was like maybe like 20 bucks a night at the time. So that was uh, really good. How mad was I? Dude, I did everything to try and save it, man. I even sent it to Seagate, and they tried to have a team of experts. No, I, I tried to send it to like a technician here, and then they tried to open the plate up, and things were all scratched and damaged. I even tried to send it to Seagate to get that taken looked at, but uh, even Seagate couldn't, like, they couldn't do anything with it, so... All the super secret streams, they're gone. They're all gone. It smells like diarrhea here. Anyways, I think this part of Hongdae is like um, not a very popular area on like th that's on stream very much. Like I've maybe come here a few times, but this little backup alleyway is pretty nice for restaurants and stuff. <clears throat> No backups? Uh, well, I'm. it's different now. I have too much backups. I have a NAS drive. I have the VODs on my Twitch account. I have I have a YouTube channel. Actually, speaking of YouTube channel, um, I don't know how many of you guys know this, but I have a YouTube channel strictly for my Twitch VODs, and that is uh, www.youtube.com slash cooksucksvods. The original version of the original version of that channel got terminated two years ago, and we had to rebuild our VOD channel. And I am right now in the process of uploading 2000, 2019 vods, and uh, all of the vods from 2000, like January. Oh no, no, sorry, June 2022 till today are there. Most collabs are on there as well. Um, but I will say, uh, I don't know if this is a congratulations or not, 
But finally, I think our current VOD channel has caught up on the subs that we lost from the main original channel. The original channel, I think, had like maybe 3,000, almost 3,300 subscribers on that VOD channel, but now we're at 3,100, which is pretty huge. And all the VODs are there for free. You guys can watch and you can you know, fast forward or whatever. And uh, yeah, we are slowly but surely getting all the original old VODs on there, including YouTube streams and Instagram streams, all that stuff. And uh, I don't know, I think that's like a cool announcement to make. If you guys haven't checked it out already, please uh, watch anything. Most of the, oh my God, shit. Most of the VODs start from Korea season two onwards. And um, I'm hoping that by the end of this month, or not this month, by the end of next month, 2019 is gonna be up and then- That's nice. Korea's next. Ooh, Jake Doe. CKS Woo. Thank you, baby. Let's go check out this little alleyway. I want to go find this, like a bear brick store, Kid Robot. I don't know if it's still around here. You've been catching up on the Canada streams. Oh, the Vancouver stuff? Hell yeah, baby. So I have tried to organize the VODs in the best way possible for different playlists. But like, if you go on the YouTube, uh, if you go on the YouTube channel itself, like from your computer, if you click on the playlist button, then it's kind of messy because everything's out of order. But if you go on the channel page itself, underneath is where the playlists are organized the best way. So the, the top one should be 2024. The next one is like all the collaborations that I've done. Then 2023, 2022, 2021, 2020, 2019, and then all the other like series blah 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 but mostly everything is organized via month and um, I think I've been, I, I've been thinking about this for a while I might be doing a 24 hour rerun channel uh, I don't know if I'm gonna be doing it on YouTube or on Twitch but it's just gonna be 24 hours of cook sucks VODs all day every day I know probably not many people will watch it but it doesn't hurt to have that going. Is there a Double Dragon playlist with Jake? Uh, no. All the old stuff is not there yet, so we have to redo it. Yeah. Where am I going? Dude, it's fucking rainy outside. All my, I think my camera's gonna be broken after this stream. Dang. I think I had a dinner with Tiffany around here one time. What happened to her? Oh, what the heck? Hold on a second. Detroit pizza, what? Wait, was that always there? She's traveling the world? Damn. That's nice. She's a flight attendant at Qatar? Really? That's awesome, dude. Does that mean I could uh, make that stream that we, the collab stream we did public again? <laughs> Can I make it public again or is she still forcing me to keep that redacted? This place is Detroit Pizza. Yeah, this little uh, hangout spot here in Hongdae is like a lot of little toy shops and knickknacks everywhere, you know? Sorry guys, I know this chill, this stream is like super chill, but like when, when, when the weather's like this, you can't really do much. Oh. 
open till 11. Tiffany was your favorite snipe. I thought I was gonna say hi and dip, but she wanted to hang out. We went to for food in K Town and stuff. She was what New York. If I committed a crime, I'm sure the government would have could have recovered your vods. True. Dude, I should get out of the rain, bro. I'm getting fucking wet. Um. Shit. Should I just... Shit, should I just call this, boys? <sighs> yeah, the port... All my ports are getting wet right now. Fudge! Yeah, it was a Seagate hard drive, but it fell, and they said something about the plates were scratched. Um, no, I don't have an umbrella. I have to buy one. Fuck it, let's go buy one. No, 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 station, I can't get pizza because I got to have dinner in like one and a half hours. Is this? Wait, is this where homeless people? There's a bathroom here. Wait, what the fuck? Is, is this like a homeless alley? <laughs> okay. Let's get an umbrella. Oh. L, I was, I don't know, I was just in some alleyway here in Hongdae. Ocho, 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 Ocho. No content stream is best stream. See you. Oh, there's a GS25. Let's get an umbrella there. Ah! That was my house? Bro, look, not everyone can have a McLaren like you, dude. But my I don't live in a fucking homeless shelter. I'm a I'm a top tier one percent IRL streamer, okay? You got a McLaren, I got a McDonald's meal. Not a I guess if I had a McDonald's franchise that would be more. <laughs> you got a McLaren, I got a Mickey D's Big Mac sandwich. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Can't pick Mickey D's. <sighs> Shit, this is like, um, such a uncomfortable streaming time period right now. Like, this actual physical time. Like, no one's really, like, I had to have started earlier or a little bit later. That's, that's the thing. But... Fuck it, there's an emote here. Did they follow me? Who? Who? Hiya! Hiya! Ah, shit! Chojo-so, yo! Nomu chojo-so! Watch, the minute that I buy this umbrella, it's gonna be dry as fuck and I'm just carrying around some unnecessary shit. Okay. <laughs> 65 centimeters, just like me. 
Let's go. Oh my god. Oh, McDonald's. No, McDonald's didn't follow me yet. 7,500. Oh, yo. Thank you. Hold on. Dude, this weather sucks. I would I would much rather prefer like a cold, cold snowy day than one of these disgusting slushy You know what I mean? Still better than the humid SEA? Yeah. Dude, L, I'm gonna tell you, if you're afraid or bothered by judgmental Korean stairs, it's not as bad as it was up until last year. Okay, I think everyone has given up now. There's so many fucking YouTubers and content creators here in Korea, they've, they've all given up. That's why like, I actually don't mind streaming in Korea anymore. Like, I used to hate it. I really hated streaming here. But it, it's not that bad. It's, it's really Japan that sucks. No offense, I love Japan, but streaming in Japan's a nightmare. I think most Twitch streamers have uh, decided and agreed that uh, Japan as a content for, or as a, as a country for content is kind of dead now, so. No one, no one is going to be going back there for a long time. Unfortunately or fortunately, I don't know. Good for the, good for the Japanese people, but I don't think, I don't think their economy is going to be affected too much if streamers stop going. <laughs> you know what I mean? Most Japan streamers just stand outside the konbini. Ah, not that's not true, dude. There's a lot of good content creators in Japan. Yeah. Listen, it's not that there's a lot of shitheads that ruined it. People have been ruining it for many years. It's just the people, the people uh, just don't want to deal with it anymore. Yeah. I am not Japan compatible. But when we did the toy shopping streams, it was perfectly fine. Ah, uh, it's just one of those days. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, thanks for coming and joining me on a wonderful little uh, rainy day walk through Seoul, Korea. Um, time went by super fast, to be honest. I know this is like a really short stream, but Uni just texted me and she's saying that uh, she's going to be here in about... 45 minutes, so I either can just stall and keep streaming for 45 minutes or I can just be like, alright, I think it's about time to call it, call it an end, but um, we can go over all the stuff that I talked about beforehand, like right, right now, but if you weren't here for the beginning of the stream, so I was saying that I'm here in Korea. Okay, l l let's do this whole song and dance one more time. I'm here in Korea 
originally to just have like a final fun adventure with uh, my fellow Korean streamer friends before Twitch Korea shuts down. But luckily, or not luckily, th there's obviously many methods and solutions for these streamers to stay on Twitch after the end of February. Um, some of them will choose to, some of them will choose not to. It's all really up to them. I'm not here to force anyone to stay streaming. I'm just here to merely be a uh, assistance and show one way, not the only way. There's many different ways, but obviously there's a lot of streamers here that don't have even that option. So uh, some of the people that I'm gonna be meeting up with this week, um, besides Uni and UEB tonight, I'm gonna be meeting up with, uh, wait, Ginny, Ginny was public with what she did? Um, I'm gonna be meeting up with May, Miochi, Delphine, Ming Ming, Schmagenta, Froggy on Tuesday. I think we're gonna do a Froggy camping trip again sometime at the end of the month or whatever. Iris is gonna be coming in February, the first week. Um, who else? Who else? I'm gonna be maybe going to Taiwan for uh, Iris's birthday for a few days, like for a weekend or something. Maybe if it's if it's just that cold here, I don't know. I, I wanted to do like a little trip anyways to Hong Kong to buy some toys, so that's like a good little excuse to leave the country and renew my visa anyways, because you know my visa only lasts for like 90 days and I have to renew it. So if I don't if I don't leave in the middle of the uh, middle of January, then I really have to leave before mid-February, so I kind of want to renew my visa. Um, Miss Hang Gang, we already met with Satan Mate yesterday, uh, so we're going to be doing a stream sometime later. I'm going to be meeting up with Miss Amy as well, and uh, whoever else. Barry, Barry has signed with the NPE agency. So, you know, that's that's the route that she chose. Who knows? I think I think Yugi is the next announcement that's gonna go public. I think that was already hinted at on Nini Bay's Instagram story. But uh, yeah, like I said, there's there's plenty of options. And for everyone that's worried about these Korean streamers, there's nothing to really worry about. But if you guys do know of any streamers that have predominantly English community, and they really want to stay on Twitch and they have no other options, please let them know to contact me and maybe I can help or maybe I can't. I don't know. It's up to them. I'm not, again, I'm not here to force myself and I'm not going to go out of my way. I'm only here to help people that want to be helped and that's it. Otherwise, otherwise, uh, that's kind of the end of the announcement. Uh, yeah, a lot of streamers will be streaming on Kick, but what about EXBC? I think EXBC is gonna be just fine. They're they're they have decided to stay on Twitch. Yeah, NP is run by Oilers who are viewers. Hey man, that's. That's pretty awesome if, if they have figured out a way how to set it up and the streamers need, choose to go that route, then that's, that's their choice. Hopefully, hopefully it's a, it's a good choice. I don't know. I don't know too much details about that stuff. I thought no one liked kick. I don't think there's anything wrong with kick. Kick is just another option. The more options, the better. Okay. You don't want there to be a monopoly anywhere. Yeah. Even for me, if Kick offered me like a pretty good sizable amount of money, yeah, I would stream on Kick. Why not? I actually may or may not be having a meeting with an executive at Africa TV sometime before I leave because uh, they've been interested in talking to me for the last three years uh, because they have been trying to. Um, Kind of push their international viewership and presence 
So we are going to have that meeting maybe. I don't know. They, we, we've been talking about having a meeting for three years. But now that I'm back in Korea for a, a little bit long time, who knows? Maybe, maybe they're interested. Maybe they're not anymore. I don't know. But I'm just trying to think what... I don't know what kind of benefit I can bring because viewership... International viewership on Africa TV is not easy. And even as an IRL streamer, to get the technology to working for me, it's not... I don't know. They're only looking at SEA now? Yeah, but I'm... I'm not... What? Okay, so they're, they reached out to me for... For what then? Do I think I'll be IRL streaming in a decade? I don't think so. I'll be 50. Did they become interested in me after my free berry stream? No, they wanted to reach out to me in 2022. I don't know if you guys remember, but I was gonna have a business here in Korea. Oh, let me go sit down there. I was gonna have a business here in Korea with another uh, like former Twitch employee. And we we're gonna start a company here, but that was around the time when I was gonna be meeting up with Africa TV in the first time, like 2022, right after the Double Dragon. Cook, you have no idea how much I missed your Korea streams. <sighs> you made IRL history in Korea. Thanks for all the past memories and the ones to come. Thanks, Kim. You are the realest dude around. Stay awesome. Yeah. Yeah, and. When I was here three months ago, after China, we were gonna have that uh, we were gonna have that uh, conversation again, but I was sick. So who knows? I mean, they Africa contacted EXPC and some other streamers like Charming Joe and other people, but who knows? It's not like. It's not like they're only looking at Southeast Asia. South, they're, they're looking at Southeast Asia for expansion. But content creators wise, it's always good to have the conversation early. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Will we see Joe on my stream? If I have a good content idea, I will have Joe on my stream. But I think Joe is going to have me on as one of his guests sometime before I leave, like at his studio. So that's going to happen. Uh, Satan mate, I already met her yesterday, but we're thinking of some content to do. Because she's going to stay on Twitch, I think. Even though most of her stuff is, I don't know, she, Satan made is really needs some help to grow more. Yeah, I don't know. I want to introduce her to uh, Miyochi, actually. She's got to meet with Miyochi. Yeah, interview stream with me. Um... I don't know. I mean, is there anything that I'm not... I should be talking about that I forgot to talk about? I feel like today is the day to have, like, all the information out there so that starting, you know, not tom tomorrow, we're just going to go boom, 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 boom. This is like the boys' super secret desktop stream, but IRL. Is Ewan going to be okay? Oh, my God. Ah, ah, fuck. I'm supposed to meet with Ewan. Uh, I'm supposed to meet with Ewan. She says she wants to meet up for a collab, but I don't know what content to make with her. Uh, shit. Okay, so for those of you guys in the chat, please do me a favor. If you guys want me to stay in Korea, or not, you know what, there's no ultimatum. If you guys could do me a solid, 
please vote for me for streamer of the year award okay the links at the top I may or may not go back to LA based on the decision okay if I get nominated maybe I'll stay here in Korea and if I don't get nominated maybe I'll go back to LA and make new friends so that I can get their viewers because those viewers obviously voted for them to win an award because I want to win streamer of the year 2024 uh, but if you or if you vote then I'm like oh fuck it I'll go to the award ceremony because I'm nominated and I'll stay here for I don't know I'll, I'll think about it later but the ballot closes at the end of the week so hopefully I have some really banger streams before that closes so that it's still fresh on your minds but that would be awesome and also youtube.com slash cook sucks my main channel we have a new video every week every Sunday we have shorts there please subscribe and all the VODs are on cook sucks I mean, youtube.com slash cook sucks VODs thank you so much for all of that and um what more is there we talked about drama I'm caught up on drama I've talked about my mission here that anybody who wants to be helped I can help and uh, to be honest I think because of the some of these agencies going public it has maybe helped me be able to approach different streamers because then there's less questions involved, right? Uh, ankle? My ankle is fucked still. Um, today is probably the worst it has been in the last week and a half. And uh, that's it. Look out for more collabs in the future. I don't know what else to say. All right, guys. I think that's it. I think that's it. I'm, I'm really like spent. The weather sucks. I don't want to walk around and just stall until uni comes to meet me. I'm just done. Uh, there's a clip from Yo, very good research material. To be honest, I'm not a huge fan. Okay, I'm not. That's, it's like too too much. <coughs> Anyways, guys, thanks so much for hanging out with me for the last three hours. Nice, short, cute stream. Um, maybe I'll buy a new sweater. I don't know. Is Uni streaming? No. We got to have a conversation off stream. Bye, everybody. Maybe I'll turn the stream on again later. Most likely not. Boys and girls, welcome to 